Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to my channel. So for today's we actually we're gonna be reacting to Cardi B Big Paper Flops Nicki Minaj Crown Queen of Rap by Billboard Teasy's new lyrics and more. But before we get started, you guys already know this reaction is by the Black Tea Blog. So shout out to you guys for um, this video. If you are new to the channel. Here we do reaction and many more other type of content. So subscribe down below if you are new. Don't forget to turn the notification bell on so you can notified every single time I upload a new video. Also, do not forget to follow me on my social media platforms. The links will be in the description box down below for your convenience. I have Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, and TikTok. And also, I have a second channel, so definitely go ahead and subscribe on that channel as well. The link will be in the description box down below. All right, let's get started. Hi guys, and welcome back to Black Tea. It's your girl Ebony, and you guys already know that your girl is back with the mess. Now there are several topics that I want to talk about in this video. The first topic being none other than Cardi B's song Big Paper with DJ Khaled's album debuting at number 86 on this week's Billboard Hot 100. Talk about a mess. Now look, when the song Big Paper did come out, there were mixed emotions. Some people actually liked the song, and others felt that Cardi B was blatantly trying to diss someone in the song. With that being said, it does seem that the general public wasn't too fond of the song. Let's be honest though, there's no video. However, the song did not get the wide reception that I think they anticipated. Now, several people have chimed in on social media about this debut, one person saying this. Big toilet paper is such a hit with the locals. Ch Whoa. Oh my gosh, that is so rude. That's so mean. Hell a mess. Not big toilet paper. Y'all grimy on Twitter. Y'all are out of pocket. But chill, it is. They are out of pocket on Twitter. Twitter is a terrible place to be at. Twitter is mm, bad. It's bad for your mental health. The way they can just like go, like go off on you on Twitter is ridiculous. Twitter. Mm. That's why I'm not on Twitter like that, but I probably should because apparently there's more um, tea that get dropped out there, so what it is and with that being said i just want to make a comment i think when music you know gets blinded by intentional vendettas it really does blind the creative process and it was very clear that in big paper cardi b was coming after someone although every <laughs> sucked and was mediocre at best i think that blinded her creative process but let's be clear cardi b can make a hit that's not the problem i think that she can only make a hit when she has a team but when she's by herself i think that she does need that help now the next topic i want to talk about is none other than Nicki minaj breaking the internet and also causing a 4900 spike in the buying of pink crocs chow talk about the queen of rap and talk about influence on the culture so you guys know that Nicki Minaj did make her return to social media yesterday yes she did jaw-dropping photos with a very cute pink Chanel aesthetic and in her photo she was this is the picture you hear me like when I just look at this I'm amazed she looks so beautiful the picture the theme everything about it is barbs like it just creams barbs it's just it's amazing I'm just looking at the picture like wow Perfect actually wearing pink crocs that were bedazzled now after this happened market watch did say that there was an increase in google searches for pink crocs and just today we are learning that the pink croc sales actually skyrocketed 4900 percent just because Nicki minaj was seen in a picture with pink crocs now if that's not influence i don't know what is mm -hmm. i mean think about it this way when people become famous or in the music industry for instance they want to aspire to be like beyonce status they also want to aspire to be like someone like Drake or even Nicki Minaj. And for Nicki Minaj not to even say the word croc. I switched from State Farm because of this site. They had me paying a hundred commercials. There we go. Just to be pictured. And now there is a huge spike in croc sales. But one thing about her supporters, they are good supporters. They really remind me of 
you know, the beehive, beehive for Beyonce. Because if Beyonce puts something, her supporter will go purchase it with her saying it or not. And that's just how this Crocs situation went. Just like that. First of all, Crocs, y'all need to give my girl a check. And second Period. of all, it just shows Nicki Minaj is still that girl. And will be so until she decides that she wants to go away and retire. Now, with that being said, I also want to talk about Nicki Minaj. Oh, that's my girl, Octavia. Being honored by Billboard as the top female rap artist of the 20... The girl that said period, that's um, also a YouTuber. Her name is Octavia. But, um, yeah, she's also cool. You guys should check out her channel. I love watching her. Her name is Glamazon Tate on YouTube. Shout out to you, boo. A tense decade. I also especially like the write-up that Billboard did do for Nicki Minaj and also how they named her the Queen of Rap. This is what they said. Nicki Minaj is one of the biggest, boldest voices in hip-hop. Nicki Minaj broke through as a fiery rhymer out of Queens before landing with Lil Wayne and Young Money in the early 2000s. Since dropping her multi-platinum 2010 debut Pink Friday, she's emerged as the preeminent queen of hip-hop, setting a new standard by easily shifting between razor sharp cutting rhymes and chart topping pop hits such as her top five 2012 collaboration with justin bieber beauty and a beat now i really thought this was a cute write-up and i want to tell billboard thank you for finally calling her the queen of rap you know it we know it and let's move forward in a positive way giving her her flowers while she's here because she definitely deserves them Nicki minaj was also honored with ariana grande as the two top female selling artists of the 2010 decades and then billboard also provided a list of the top females in the 2010 decades with taylor swift being number one and you know it's kind of interesting how they did this list there is no way that Katy perry and some of these other artists are over beyonce that's just my opinion i love Katy perry but there's no way that beyonce is at 23 with exactly she dominated the 2010s. I do agree with most of the list. Adele, you know, Lady Gaga. All of these people are influential to the culture. But Beyonce, I just right. don't think she should be 23. Especially under artists who have never made any milestones that Beyonce has made. But with that being said, I'm happy that they're being honored. And I do agree with the sentiment that both Rihanna, Nicki Minaj, Beyonce, Ariana Grande, and Lady Gaga, Adele are women who definitely influence decade time. Now with that being said, talking about Billboard, they are now going to be recognizing Drake as the top artist of the Billboard decade. You know, he deserves that. He has more Billboard awards than any other artist in history, so I did not see that being um, changed, and I didn't see it going to The Weeknd, who was the predecessor if he did not win this award. With that being said, yep. Drake has always been doing his thing. You know, he's always dominating the charts. I think it's great that he's going to be recognized, but I also think that there are also other artists like The Weeknd and other artists who have also been dominating the charts. But let Drake get his award and I hope to see some changes, especially in the upcoming award ceremonies. Mm -hmm. Now before we end this video, I gotta talk... Yes. Like... We hired the hotel man, so you can save a lot. This tea is indeed hot. This tea is indeed hot. You guys just check out the picture. Like, whoa. Okay, her picture is just astonishing. Talk about Nicki Minaj posting these fire photos on Instagram. Now, Nicki, you cutting up. Okay, I see what type of era this gonna be. Cutting so my up. My girl is cutting up. She's cutting up. <laughs> you bitches ready? <laughs> okay, are y'all ready? Because she's back. See, Nikki said, come sit in my Chanel office so I can gather y'all. Because we're going to have a board meeting to remind y'all that the boss is back. Period. Let's get into the caption, though. On Nicki Minaj's Instagram. The but one thing about Nikki is that her caption will will um hit. Her caption always, like, be shitting on people. And that's for people that hate her. Like, that's for people that don't really mess with her like that. Like, if you read her caption... You're going to feel attacked. That's why most of these other female rappers feel attacked. I'm not going to say no name. But if you know, you know. I say what I said. Body is looking fire. But this is what Nikki had to say. B-words act like they want action. Heard they want action. B-word. We ain't ducking no action. I'm about to give them that traction. Send a distraction. Then I'm going to light them like fractions. Chill. Did somebody 
paw for the queen. She's cutting up. She's already cutting up. Nikki, see, this is why I can't stand this girl. She is cutting up. And I a lot of people can understand her because of that. I live. I live. Get a Nikki, period, queen. It's the dress. It's the hair. It's, it's the, the body. Shoes for me. And it's all. The body. The body, yaddy, 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 yaddy. Is the body. Also, the face with no fillers. Period. No shade. Put on T all shade all effects. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> the face with no fillers. I'm dead. <laughs> she said, I'm going to line them like fractions. That went over your head, girl. I know it did. But read it again so you understand that the queen is back. I would. Yes. The queen is back. Period. I want to hear from you guys down below. How do you feel about the whole song with Big Paper debuting at number 86 on the Billboard Hot 100? What do you think about the song? And do you think that there's anything Cardi B could have done differently to get more reception from the general public? What are your thoughts on Billboard naming Nicki Minaj the best female rapper of the decade? How do you feel about the spike in Crocs by Nicki Minaj just taking a picture? And yeah. what are your thoughts on the top women of the decade as far as Billboard goes? Do you think Beyonce should be higher, or do you think she's where she needs to be? I look Please let me know down below. I really want to know because I do think she should be higher for sure. Before to reading your comments, don't forget to subscribe, ping that bell notification so you never miss when I upload. And give this video a huge Beyonce. Beyonce. One thing about Beyonce is baby, she will be serving looks, body, and everything. She definitely needs to be higher, and her music is just fire. Her influence is out there. The behalf should definitely be down below in the com in the comment section telling me she should be number one not number one but at least at the top or maybe number one <laughs> up so i can be exposed to more great subscribers like you um thank you guys for watching that's it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it because i did definitely once again comment down below what you guys think of the song you know the cardi b big paper you know flops like all those things they give me nice coming back the influence she, she 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 has with like everybody for real because most of us most of us that really like follow you know social media and all the stuff that are trending we're all like yes the queen is back for real because that picture she took in her office her chanel office at that was just crazy so yeah, let me know what you guys think down below um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to follow your girl please subscribe because a whole bunch of people watching my videos are not subscribed like what are you waiting for it is free please hit the subscribe button down below and also don't forget to turn the notification bell so you can get notified every single time i upload a new video links to everything i need you to subscribe to or follow me on is in the description box down below as well and i'll catch you guys in my next one bye